General is criticizing what he called UNM's lack of transparency, and he's going straight to the top for answers. He sure is. The AG is sending his demands in a new letter straight to UNM's president and the Board of Regents. News 13's Fernanda Lopez is here with the details. Good morning, Fernanda. Good morning, Crystal and David. Here's the letter. In it, Attorney General Hector Balderas is asking for big changes in transparency as his office continues its investigation into the university. Last May, Balderas announced he would be launching an investigation, including a criminal review of UNM's use of public funds and possible abuse of privileges. It all stemmed from a Larry Barker investigation, which uncovered a lavish $60,000 golf trip to Scotland paid with taxpayer money. Now, in a new letter to President Garnett Stokes and UNM's Board of Regents, A.G. Balderas is calling out the university, saying they're not fully cooperating with investigators. The letter says, quote, we have encountered numerous deficiencies, omissions, and delays in our requests for documents and apparent misrepresentations. He uses withheld emails as an example. In the letter, he asks UNM to change the, quote, tone at the top saying they need to put a stop to practices that threaten the future of the university and the rights of students. He also called out the university's ongoing budget problem saying UNM quote continues to propose tuition increases and cuts into students services and activities as a means of addressing years of financial and administrative mismanagement. Back to you. All right, thanks so much, Fernanda. Shaking things up just a bit. According to the New Mexican, President Stokes responded to the AG's letter saying UNM has provided 12,000 pages of documents and will continue to cooperate and welcomes input from the AG's office.